Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to our Austrian playthrough in EU4. I'm going to be your host at Lucky Marine. And we're going to... 6, 7, 8, 9. We'll leave you on there. And we're also going to chuck our siege leader back on. Well, our, our glorious leader anyway. Right, you go back on. What about the nobles? I shall tax modifier. Go on then. Now we could probably have supported that fight, however, I don't want to leave this isolated at all. I know there's another 20 odd stack knocking about. Castile might get there. Castile did get there. Castile actually turned that fight. France occupied Sternberg. Huh. Yeah, we need to be marching into here as soon as uh, it comes under threat. Papal State. Why are you moving off here? What has happened? I don't know. Well, let's concentrate on what we need to do. Taking the French capital will help a lot. Now, I've not seen any of our forts fall yet. Bohemia built a fort up here. That was probably quite smart of them actually. Ooh, excellent. Alright, into positive numbers on Paris. And some dude has died. Simply cost. Go on then. And at some point they're gonna hit us in Paris. They're not just gonna allow this to happen. But it is just in farmlands. So And they have the penalty because we took from the Age of Discovery this, the adaptive combat terrain. But they shouldn't have that. They shouldn't have that. Because our capital is in the mountains. So that's not it. You're getting a plus one because you took it. Fucking awful. Yeah, it looks like we're gonna have to uh, get the papal state out. They're having too much of an influence. Okay, okay. Yeah. Well, 14, 20,000 just from the papal state. It's unacceptable. Still don't get how half of them split off one way and half of them split off the other. We should have done this early doors, I suppose. Come on, people, stay out. Avignon Provence. 
and there'll be no Avignon. Not in the HRE. Provence? How can you release Provence? What province have you got that will go back to Provence? There'll be no. Oh, I suppose Avignon. Avignon can either be Avignon or Provence. Okay. How much money do you have? Not much. Not enough to... Uh... Nah, let's just get them out. Next. Genoa. Genoa's nowhere really. Going. No, it was just uh, it was just the Papal State that were making a massive influence in that fight. Yeah. Gain manpower or lose prestige. I'll gain the manpower. Check your in charge. You peace out. Nope. How are you black flagged then? then? Alright, go. Money. War reps. I'll do. Hi now. A similar situation with you. your money then. Okay, we're going to keep you in so that we can get your money. How far away are we? Quite far. But then, Genoa doesn't have anything that we can really get to. No, we'll just let Genoa out. Relative strength of alliances and all that. We just need to go put a little bit of pressure on high now to get them out. Oh, yeah. Now we can concentrate on France. Still, why have you black flagged yourself and continued to black flag yourself? Looks like it's turned into siege racing. So 
we can spread out a little bit around here. Ancestors are watching. Lose money, 20 prestige, 20 legitimacy. We do need all the legitimacy we can get. Now France being here on Hungarian forts means nothing to me. We might even send a small party back. To break the siege. Maybe if I take this land for us. It'll stop Castile getting black flagged. Danzig, Protestant Reformation. Nope. Breaking insurance, great relations. Okay, we need to go in there and we need to uh, force our religion. Our truth. Oh, it's ages. Well, we're not going to be taking land. All we're going to be doing is forcing religion. We have to go do it. The Ottomans have joined. Interesting development. You can join if you want. Them. Sounds like it's part of the Holy Roman Empire. Yep, they uh, added themselves. Okay, Danzig. We can't allow. We need to stamp on as many centers of reformation as we can. Or we can take one out this easily, this quickly, just by other cost a bit of stability. Then we have to do it. A bit of stability. Five stabilities. Yep, we'll take three three people. Five all, breaking truth, yep, I know. Needs to happen. Has to happen. Yeah, it's worse than. 
You come back. You come back. I'll take a coalition, or a threat of a coalition, in order to uh, to get rid of a centre of reformation. Yeah, we're not going to be able to convert this for a while because of religious zeal, but. It'll be alright. It'll be fine. Now you come back. That's not going to happen, happen anytime soon. You're at 21%. Release nations. Malice for Holland. I think we do. Yeah, we're going to have to get Holland back. Clear that. Cancel that subject. We're not going to be able to take any line for ourselves. War ups, nope. Release nations, nope. We'll come back another time. Now is really not. <laughs> now is really, really not the time to be uh, to be grabbing aggressive expansion. Cologne, Lorraine, Munster. Cologne, what have you done? Cologne, one. Munster, you've taken out Oldenburg, but you would. Oh, that's frozen, even. Wittenberg. Really? What else have you got? Oh, this. No, nope, that's fine. Brandenburg. I already know about Brandenburg, I think. You've taken out. Damn you. We're probably going to get to the point where we'll, uh, we'll just fabricate and declare war on Brandenburg and make him spit out a lot of people. Right, cannon stack. Let me go all the way up here. What is it that we want from this war? We want to get rid of the center of reformation. Right now. False religion. Done. Converting the province to Catholic will destroy the center of reformation. Because it's a one promise minor. If it was to spawn in Brandenburg and it'd be maybe in Kohlberg, just forcing their religion wouldn't be enough. We'd have to take this province from them and convert it ourselves. Okay, alright.
Pomeranian separatists. Calm yourself. Brandenburgian, just Brandenburgian. That's all. Let me disaster. Yep. Let's go and sort out the Brandenburgian. Sternberg and Newmark. Wait, what? Sternberg and Burgundian, Brandenburgian. Yeah, of course. Did we ever increase the autonomy over here? I think it's changed hands so many times. I know. See if Danzig is over. Right, let's do this quickly. The longer we wait, the more the Center of Reformation is converting other stuff. What is this? Protestant Center of Reformation in... Den we need to go to war with Denmark then. Switch peace. False religion. Whatever money you have. War ups. Fine. Okay. Okay. Catholic. No center of reformation. Senate of Reformation. Breaking a truce? Nope. Muscovy Ward. I don't think we can do Muscovy. But we can't really wait. Thankfully, we've got rid of one. Uh, when does our truce with you expire? Oh, fairly soon. Two years we can go in and we can take Stettin for ourselves. We can force Brandenburg, force the religion, take Stettin, um, but we also need. We're also under this from Denmark. The old bit of desire is at a hundred percent, which means Sweden won't get involved in fights. We need to do this. Even with the threat of a coalition hanging over us, we need to do this. Bah, what have you eaten? I'm, I mean, I'm impressed, but you're going to have to spit it back out. I'm sorry. Should go back to Nevers. Burgundy. <laughs> so Burgundy. Oh my God. Burgundy's back as a uh, as a one province miner inside the HRE. Not bad. We might even be able to uh, feed him his cores back. Nope, doesn't have any more. Anyway, back to the subject at hand, which is Denmark. If we get if we get too weak, this coalition is going to fire. I guarantee it. Damn you, Danzig! But we can't wait. Just have to make sure that we don't get too weak. Ten. 
and ten. You probably won't get involved. You're at nine. Oh, Muscovy has a decent military leader though. Hopefully Poland being the rival, they won't leave, won't allow the Muscovite troops through. But I can't guarantee that. No, this needs to happen now. As in, in the next episode. And it will. I'll be looking Marine as always. You, if, if you're in the HRE, if you're leader of the HRE, you want it to be one religion, and you want that one religion to be Catholic. You don't want it to be flipping to anything else. So soon, as soon, as soon as the centers of Reformation pop, you need to be on them. You need to try and keep your aggressive expansion low so that when you declare no CB wars against people to to even though we had a CB uh, it was breaking the the truce but I had to it, it, it had to go it already converted one province it was on its way to converting more um, you have to jump on them as quickly as you can and that's what we're gonna have to do and that's what we are gonna do right now uh, it'll probably mean a coalition pop. They're going to see us as weak, fighting another war. Coalition will probably pop, and then, well, we'll probably try and snuggle out of it the way we did the last one, uh, just by releasing a few countries. But, yeah, we are miles behind where we're meant to be right now. Oh, anyway, until next time, do take care.